Now I'm going to play a very short clip from the Today programme for the purpose of review and comment. Having said you can't nick bits from other radio, um, I, th I think this is so so um, particular. It's worth it's worth having having a listen to. It was it was a, yesterday they were talking about um, apprenticeships. Uh, UCAS now have information about apprenticeships as an alternative to degrees and during this uh, there was d uh, uh, Justin Webb offered an opinion about degrees or so social science and humanities degrees uh, he didn't include science and technology degrees but uh, anyway have a have a listen to it and see see what see what you think uh, let's just get this lined up. OK, here we go. You've got to be up for work now. I mean, I'm just, <laughs> without being too facetious about it, if you're doing um, humanities or social sciences or something, you've basically got three years of quite an easy life at university, potentially. Uh, you hadn't if you're doing an apprenticeship. Well, I, I thought that was quite strange because there wasn't, there wasn't any contrary view. Well, the, la the lady from UCAS said she found her own politics degree hard work or sufficiently demanding. Uh, but I'm, I'm surprised there hasn't been more comment on that. Um, also, I've discovered that in Exeter, the drama is part of communications. There's a, there's a whole department uh, with the word communications quite, quite up, up front, and it includes... Um, various things and I think it might include te some technology or digital media aspects as well I, I heard about it when I when I visited the digital humanities lab where they've got a very good um, sort of rec it's, well it's not for radio but it's a sound recording and video recording studio and also equipment for transferring between formats and um, that's part of the communications um, department, I think department. Uh, so that that suggests to me that all these things are getting more more muddled up. Uh, I think it is still f humanities, but social science could come into it, me media studies or something like that. Some of these things might might be connected or, or reference each other in some sort of way, and. Also, I've noticed that the what used to be the London College of Printing became the London College of... So I think it's, it's ended up as communication anyway. I think it's the London College of Communication now, of which printing is a, is a part, but it's only, it's only one part of it. So possibly li literature or what, where, where that would have fitted in with humanities... Um, that might be just one part of, of a wider sort of communication going on. And maybe uh, you do a degree and some of it, it has a, an application of some kind. Um, so I'd, like, I'd, I'd just like to know a bit more about that. And if anybody's got any comments about it, how, how actually a, a social science or humanities degree is, is different as being less demanding than an apprenticeship or uh, w whatever the Today programme thinks about it, about it all. Um, quite a lot of people at the BBC, I think, came, came via humanities degrees. And um, the, the techie bits in the studio, well, I don't, I don't, I don't know. Um, this is the We Don't Know show, and you're... you're Although I'm do, I'm doing the um, putting CDs in the CD player and everything, as well as talking, uh, there's the odd gap here and there. Uh, this this should be Marvin Gaye now. No, it's not. That's wrong, wrong, wrong one. 